Hi guys, so today I'm going to be talking about the uh, Fallout 4 trailer that was released just an hour ago. Um, my overall thoughts was for the fact that normally Bethesda games come out about a year um, after they're initially announced, so we're looking at November 2016, probably not this year at all, uh, but we'll hear more around E3, which is in a week. And but yeah, uh, the fact that it looked amazing, considering it could be a year until it's even developed, and they've got settings like that. A lot of people are saying the settings gonna be Boston, 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 but we have no idea. Um, the dog, the dog was really interesting. I don't know if it could be dog or it's just a thing, or if the dog's gonna be a playable character as in like Riley and. Uh, Cod Ghosts, um, no idea, uh, it'll be interesting to see, I think it'll be really exciting, um, no idea whether it's going to be, I mean the dog's going to be, could be a playable character, it could just be a companion, like Chop in GTA, um, no idea but it definitely looks an interesting game and uh, I'll definitely be checking it out. Uh, at Bethesda's, I think Bethesda's got a panel at E3, and um, I'll be looking forward to seeing anything about it, so um, I'll try and get a Tomb Raider video up, I'm also going to try and get an Agradius guys up, I don't know if I'll get it today, I don't know, I'll definitely try to get one of it today, but if I can't get it, I can't get it. So just some, I'm just testing the uh, the system, my editing stuff to see if it works because I'm using new software such as the uh, the the uh, the I think it's called the Video Pad Editor Pro. So I'm using that. Um, but yeah, overall, I hope it's Boston because I think Boston will be a really good location for the game. The fact they showed the vaults. I don't know if it'll be the same nuclear things as in Fallout. They, they like if it's the same nuclear destruction just from a different area, told from a different perspective. Um, or if it'd be a completely different. Maybe the world's been stabilized again, and they've gone back through the ages, back to like the point where they were, when another nuclear wars were, and then they realized they weren't really able to survive. Or if it would just be told from another area and another perspective. I'd be interested to find out. And uh, I'm definitely looking forward to the E3 panel. So I'll be doing a lot of videos on E3. I will also be starting videos on doing the Elder Scrolls Online as that comes out in six days on the Xbox One. So definitely looking forward to that. So if you want to see more of that, just stay tuned for more book, game, TV, film and trailers, game trailers, movie trailers, TV trailers, whatever. And uh, thank you for watching. So I will see you next time.